You are now watching 100 TV, where we always keep it 100 over here. No clickbait, no cab news, just real authentic content. The 100 way. It's 100 TV. We back with another one, y'all. Like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to share this video like you're sharing your baby mother, because you know she cheating on you, man. But let's get to it, man. It's a crazy day in hip hop right now. We got your boy Meek Mill, man. Going at it with DJ Academics once again for the hundredth time. You know Meek Mill and Ack been beefing for years. Stemming way back since Drake dropped that back to back on him. But now it looks like, man, the fire is starting to burn once again. Cause we got your boy Meek Mill talking about the governor called him. And Meek Mill told the governor, yes, I'm talking about the governor. Now, I don't even know how Meek Mill and the governor is talking, because Meek Mill is a gangster rapper, so I don't know. But Meek Mill is saying that the governor called him, and Meek Mill told the governor that DJ Academics is responsible for a lot of murders. Yes, DJ Academics is responsible for murders. Meek Mill told the governor that. Now tell me what do y'all feel about that? Like how do y'all feel? Is that snitching? Cause Wag 100 chimed in and Wag 100 said that Meek Mill is a rat, man. Now we all know that DJ Act ain't physically hurt nobody, but Meek Mill is trying to say that, I guess DJ Academic's voice, the war in Chirac, when he was doing that, I guess he is saying that that led to a lot of people getting killed. Because I don't think Pooh Shiesty could get the governor on the phone, you know? So I don't know. I could be wrong. Maybe Mick Mirror's on some other stuff. I don't know. I don't know. Like I said, I'm just bringing y'all the news, man. This is what's happening right now, man. Mick Mirror's and DJ Academics is going to war. But let's check out some of this content of DJ Academics and Rap 100 speaking on the Mick Mill situation don't forget to like comment and subscribe we out here let me call whack 100 because i need the streets to answer for this what up bro whack i'm gonna be honest we with you clubhouse live streaming you right now hey shout out to everybody on clubhouse the hundred side i i just we're gotta talk side and we in stone alone right now hey What's i just up? i just gotta talk to some people who you know i i you know everything i know about you whack you come from a certain place where the streets move a little different and y'all move how I've heard it's supposed to move. I just want to ask you a question. From what I was told, actually not what I was told, what I read online, Meek and me was like, again, I reported something that was a public lawsuit. He, he felt his beef was only with me, not with the person who said it, not with the allegation. But all of a sudden, he said, yo, I'm finna, like, pull up to your crib. I'm about to do this. I'm about to do that. I said, whatever. Wait, okay. wait, wait, stop, stop. Wait, stop, act. Same shit he did to 6 9 And then when 6 9 pulled up on him, he started hollering about some other shit. Dude was a bitch. Exactly. He said 6 9 was trying to trick him off the street, even though he claimed but he was going to make an example. he said he was going to fuck 6 9 up when he seen him. Exactly. Now, when you see him... Nigga, you know when you dealing with street shit, it ain't no appointments. You see it, nigga. However it is, it happened. Six nine pulled up on him, jumped out on him, and he started blowing the whistle. Hey, so I hear the nigga called the governor on you. That, well, well, that's what I was gonna ask you because you know, I'm gonna be honest. I, I was confused because I'm a person who pride myself in doing non-criminal activity. You know, everybody gotta get it out there, get it. I understand. I'm a sidewalk nigga. It's cool. He. Said today after saying he was gonna come to my crib, he was gonna do this, that, and third. He said he he spoke to the governor, and the governor and the told governor him. Governor checked him. Yeah, the governor checked him, told him to delete the tweets, but that wasn't it. He said the he had to explain to the governor how many murders I was responsible for. Oh, he trying to put a rico on you? You think that well, nigga the nigga trying to put a rico on you? You are now watching 100 TV, where we always keep it 100 over here. No clickbait, no cab news, just real authentic content. The 100 West.